How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? This is Jeff with I Download Blog. Just as it's been reported over the past few weeks, uh, there are new Apple television channels available on the Apple TV. These are specific apps such as uh, the Disney Channel, the Disney X XD, the Weather Channel, Vivo, uh, Smithsonian Channel. Uh, so there's quite a bit of new content available. Now, unfortunately, for things uh, for the Disney channels, you actually have to uh, make sure you already subscribe to those cable channels. Uh, you have to verify that you are a Disney uh, channel subscriber or a Disney channel. You get the Disney channel, in other words, on your cable subscription. Um, so you can't just go in and watch those. With the other three apps, though, the Weather Channel, the Smithsonian Channel, and Vivo, you can actually go in. You don't have to verify anything. It's not annoying like that. Um, for instance, Vivo here, you can go in, start watching videos right off top. No problem. Um, and it works pretty much like, you know, the YouTube channel, et cetera. It has a list of popular channels, the most viewed today, um, you know, premieres, as you see there, certified, over 100 million views. So you can go through and find your favorite artist. Uh, you can do a search if you want to do that and play your favorite videos. And what's really cool about this is that it's on the big screen. That That's the big difference here with Vivo on the Apple TV. Now the Smithsonian channel kind of came out of nowhere it seemed like. Um, for some reason the icon is just black. I, I guess they just haven't finished the update completely yet. But um, when you go to the Smithsonian channel you'll see some nice uh, I guess documentaries, sort of. I have never watched this channel. If it's, I don't even know if it's a real cable channel. I'm assuming it is. Excuse my ignorance, but I have not watched this on cable television. But here, it looks like you get full episodes, full documentaries uh, on the various topics. Um, it looks pretty educational, as you can see there. This is an hour and 53 minutes on the Sistine Chapel. Um, so you can see there's a lot of content here for you to uh, enjoy. Next up is the uh, Weather Channel, and this is really handy. And the, the cool thing about the Weather Channel is it looks like a, just a full-fledged app. If you've ever used the uh, jailbroken weather app on the Apple TV, then this is going to look kind of familiar to you. Uh, it has a uh, you know an hourly forecast. There's a 10-day forecast. Uh, you get the current conditions here. You can choose, of course, your location. Um, so let's check out the hourly forecast. And like I was saying, this looks like um, the jailbroken weather app on the Apple TV. Sort of. Not exactly, but you get the point. It's an app. That's, in other words, it's an actual application. And it's not just links to videos and stuff like that or streaming content. But you actually have some data here that you can pull in uh, that's relevant to your location. You also have this um, uh, video that you can stream. It gives you the forecast for the day. So that's nice. Uh, of course, that it's going to apply to your specific location, wherever you are in the country. And that is, uh, that's really neat. The, the fact that you can get your weather updates and everything right there on your Apple TV. So as you can see, the more and more content that becomes available for the Apple TV, the more this device looks like an absolute steal at $99. I mean, there's a ton of content on here now, um, and it's only going to improve, I imagine. So I'm interested to hear what you guys have to say about the new channels available on the Apple TV. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.